And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. Seeing a range of temperatures this morning on this Tuesday morning. 38 degrees down in Crawfordsville. New Market sitting at 38 as well. 41. Frankfurt, a little warmer to the north. Look at this Rochester, 50, 46, Winnemac, 48, and Monticello. But still need that light jacket this morning. But by this afternoon, we're going to warm up nicely. This high pressure, again, as we've mentioned in this last several days, is expanding off to the west. We're going to see things really nice and clear this morning. Pretty much a cloudless sky right now. Some of these high level clouds to the north will start to sink a little southward this afternoon, but overall a nice sunny day yesterday it was fantastic to be outside. Today will be a little bit warmer, but very dry. Things are drying up very quickly ground wise just because of that powerful sun and uh, the very, very windy conditions that we're going to be seeing as well. So we might have an elevated fire threat out there. Just be extra cautious if you're going to do extra or any outdoor burning uh, for today. 78 degrees today, even warmer tomorrow. Very strong west southwest winds gusting 25, pushing about 28, 30 miles per hour at times, though we'll have some clouds in the morning. We'll only get down to about to upper 40s to lower 50 for lows and we'll work up to about 80 degrees with plenty of sun for the afternoon for Wednesday. Thursday's carbon copy of Wednesday not likely as windy, but certainly just a lot of sun. Here's some of those clouds kind of sinking a little southward, some upper level clouds overnight, and then we'll see a nice sunny day Wednesday. Thursday looks pretty nice as well, but then we'll see a little more clouds coming in for Friday. Maybe a few scattered sprinkles here and there. Nothing too widespread or hard hitting. And then we'll be watching a cold front coming in that could trigger a few scattered storms. Doesn't look like anything too widespread, but we'll keep an eye on it. Uh, but things certainly turn a little cooler here by Sunday, especially Monday, Tuesday. Not uh, very cold, but definitely we could see the potential maybe for some frost by early Tuesday morning. 79 by Thursday will kind of be ranging from the mid to upper 70s to near 80 for the next several days ahead. So that's something to just keep in mind. A very warm streak of days here ahead of us. Maybe some isolated rain chances Friday evening. A few scattered storms may be possible Saturday evening and an isolated rain chance Sunday morning before things start to cool down after that cold air starts to filter in by Monday. 55 for a high, which is below normal, but we'll get back to near normal with a cold morning on Tuesday and then back in the 70s by the middle of next week, Joe. All right, well, it's really dry again. Mm -hmm. This is more, you know, the kind of dryness that you would see during the summer. Yes. So now we're telling people, yeah. you know, be careful when you burn things, mm -hmm. watch out for brush fires. Prophetstown had a controlled burn yesterday. So right. if you noticed a lot of smoke in Northeast Tippecanoe County, that's where it was coming mm. from. They they apparently like these conditions, I guess, for these controlled burns. Exactly, and uh, but uh, shouldn't uh, just try being careful with the, if you're gonna do any outdoor burning today, just things could easily catch, and with the wind, embers could easily travel. But overall, though, a fantastic forecast, much needed after a very busy uh, end of a, uh, March yes. for us, early April, so not a bad forecast. Jim. Not a bad, and you were one of the busy ones, so I'm sure <laughs> you're liking oh, this yes. as well. Oh yes, definitely. Right. Thanks, David.